What's up guys, Matt here with Galaxy Games 843. We are at the amusement and vending, bulk vending convention. We're gonna go around and see what else here, so let's go check it out guys, let's see what's there. Look at all this amazing, there's arcade games, there's pinball, there's drivers, racers, coin pushers, there's so many things here. So amazing to see all this cool stuff in one place. We're kind of in like a like a arcade. Like you, these are the games you would see in David Buster's in this section here. Here's all the Minecraft stuff. Look at this Minecraft arcade. That's gonna be big. You'll see that soon. All these VR racer machines. Dodgeball, Ultimate Arena, how cool is that? Oh, that's awesome. Let's look at this out. Yeah, we'll see that soon. We got all kinds of change machines in here, a bunch of plush and prizes, cool stuff. Guys, look at all this stuff though, it's amazing how much stuff is here. So we're definitely gonna go search out some of the uh, different uh, vendors that we uh, definitely came here to see. Here's Smart Industries right here. Look at all this great stuff. They have a Pokemon string cutter machine. Look at this, guys. This would be right up my alley, right? A mega prize machine. It's a single single string cut machine, all Pokemon themed. How cool is that though? Look at that. As you know, Pokemon stuff is hot. So that would do really well in any location. Look at all those cool prizes. All right, over here, you've got a winner every time double up, which means you, you get a chance to win a plush. And if you don't win, then you get one of these. And you play to win to get one of these. So you always walk away with something. And how cool is that? You got some, mini, some minis there, some, some ticket rings. Let's see what's over on this side. So here's your lighted front smart machines. Very good looking stuff. I love the treasure boxes. How cool are those? I would love to do a treasure box machine, but I just don't have the location for it right now. Your typical duck machines. Here's uh, here's your big mega prize machines. They got Sonic inside there. That's cool. Here's more of your gaming stuff, like your uh, your casino gaming. There's some slot machines over here. All this cool stuff. This is by Cardinal Express. Pinball over there. Let's go check out the pinball. Everybody loves pinball, right? You know I love pinball. Let's see. This is the Stern setup. And let's see if they've got the newest stuff out. They got the new Foo Fighters machine. Look at that, guys. Oh, my God. I haven't seen this in person yet. There's the new Foo Fighters pinball. How cool is that? Man. Take a look at that play field. And one is probably the LE, one is a, the standard, or the pro they call them. Or they might both be the same, I can't tell. But how cool is that, guys? We got a Mandalorian, a Deadpool, and a Turtles over here. So good stuff. Do they have some things on the other side? Let's go check. Okay, there's more machines on this side. Here we go, we got Jurassic Park, uh, Dr. No, Godzilla, and more Foo Fighter machines over there too. So that's the Stern setup, how cool is that? Very cool. 
Very cool to check out Stern. All right, what else we got over here? I mean, I don't know what direction to go. Every direction you go, there's cool stuff to see. So over here, I do see this is, uh, I see the, the Bandai Namco station. Let's go check it out real quick. On the way over there, let's check out these cut to wins and big, uh, big prize merchandisers here. Those are awesome machines. I love how they light up so bright. You can't miss those in an arcade, right? All right, here's the Namco setup. A really cool Pac-Man air hockey table. And of course, some uh, cocktail, tall cocktails, bar setups, and then your standard uh, kind of mini multi-cage there. Those are pretty cool. I love they got posters and all kinds of cool stuff on the walls. All for the classic arcade enthusiast there. Let's go see what else we can find. Oh, let's check out all the, okay, so we got a Pac-Man a Pac Battle Royal Championship. I love these tables, they're so much fun to play. And then let's check out these Power Pellet games. I haven't seen these anywhere yet. Look at that. So, is that just for him to do more things now? Or is that is so cool. Great if you run an arcade that has ticket based uh, prizes, things like that. That would be awesome in a spot like that. Here's a row of racers, these are Dead Heat Unleashed. Very cool by Namco. They look awesome. I'll obviously link together. Probably a ton of fun to play. Man, I don't even know where to go. Let's make our way over to, um, we're, we're gonna try to find the candymachines.com table. We'll go take a look at some different things over there. Remember, we haven't done it, by the time you see this video, we, I'm sure we'll have given it away, but we're giving away a super mini claw machine from candymachines.com. So let's try and make our way over to that section. See what we can find. This place is just super nuts though, guys. There's so much cool stuff here. So glad I was able to attend this, uh, this event because it's like a giant arcade. It's so much fun. And there's all kinds of great vendors here showing off their, their new products for 2023, 2024. Uh, let's make our way over here. Uh, I can see that there's some prize vendors over here. There's some different uh, coin pusher games. You know, if you like uh, different things like that. These are a lot of the games you would see in places like uh, Dave and & Buster's and uh, more family entertainment type larger arcade systems. Check out that amazing prize locker over there. My God, how cool is that? If you run an unmanned arcade, that would be an awesome spot too. If you do want to run tickets, that would be amazing. I just keep getting totally distracted going from one place to another with all this great stuff here. All right, this is a lot of pool table, casino type stuff up here. Let's make our way back this way. ATMs here, other gaming machines, payment systems, here's some prizes. Look, they got the Squishmallows on display. You can never go wrong with Squishmallows. Awesome, awesome. I am just amazed by all the stuff that's here. All right, I see some mini claws over here. Let's go this, let's make our way over here. Let's see what kind of mini, mini machines are over here. As you know, we talk a lot about these in our, in our videos, in our live streams. Here's from SSM Vending. SSM Vending is a really great company. Look at all this cool stuff. Look at all the stuff in that machine. So awesome. They got great prizes, great bulk vending stuff. Go check out SSMVending.com. How cool is that? I love the prize locker at the top. Look at all this and all that. Everything's got, uh, got Nyax Reader. These are the Golden Houses by AZ Amusements. I mean, look how cool that is. They got, they got Nyax Readers on them with the prize lockers up top. So cool. 
Oh, right. Let's see the Galaxy machines. Here we go. Right there. There it is. We may have to get one of those machines. How cool does that look? How's it going? How's it going, man? David said you were coming by. Oh, uh, yes. <laughs> I'm Grant, by the way. Hey, Grant. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Uh, we're very impressed by your setup here. And well, I, thank you. I appreciate I, that. One of these days, I'm going to have to get my hands on one of those Galaxy machines. Gotcha. Because, yeah, I mean, just too cool. <laughs> well, I, I love these Magic Keys, too. Those are awesome machines. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, we're trying to innovate and come out with some newer style keys. Yeah. Some smaller machines for people that are smaller operators. Yeah, for sure. Some of these machines, it's just hard for people that are trying to get started in the business. Yeah. But even yeah. that will fit in the back of your car, just like a Mini will fit in the back right. of your car. Yeah. So it helps people expand faster. So. Absolutely. But... Yeah, they look really. I, I I was very much looking forward to coming and seeing these machines in person because it's hard to it's hard to scale right. online or pictures picture, and stuff. Yeah. You're like okay. What so is I think like I think these are great transitions from the mini machines to more of a like a wider style. Right. Because I know like you can probably do a little bit larger prizes in these. Can you do any bit any bit of a larger claw in these yep, type of absolutely. machines? Okay. This is just how we sell them standard. We yeah. can put a candy claw, a bigger claw. Okay. You know everything. Like we put a full size claw in one of the galaxies and fill it up with reversible octopus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's killing it. It's killing it. I'm killing sure. It. That's great. Well, thanks for t letting us take a look around. Oh, these, there's this one too. Yep, this is our cube factory. Yes. So gives you a little bit different style of playing down on the crane instead of playing like you know right yeah, at it. So. Yeah, and that's like the perfect size of claw too, yeah. right there. I think. So that's the type of claw we actually put in the galaxy. Of there. Okay. We made it so like I said, cool. it'll, it'll pick cool. up everything you wanted to. So. Awesome. Wonderful. Well, you guys have an amazing display. Thank you. I appreciate it. Very cool. That. We'll definitely uh, spend some time looking around for sure. Awesome. Sounds good. Great. And great to meet great you, by the way. You, Matt. Awesome. Thank you. All right. Here we are at the CandyMachines.com setup. Hey. My guy right here. This is Kevin with CandyMachines.com. Oh, this is the guy that makes it happen. Right? Look at all these amazing machines here, guys. I mean, this is outstanding. And then I see there's some stuff we haven't seen before. Can we talk about that? Like, what is all this over here? All right. This right here is going to be a game-changing machine. And this is a prototype, right? This is a prototype. Okay. Right. Production 60 to 90 days out. We'll get the feedback here. From okay. The show, figure out what that final production is going to look like. All right. And, you know, so it's a little bit, it's basically it's electronic bulk vending. So we've got some, some sticker or card vending up here, some, some flat vending, which is awesome because you know that does so well. And then you've got the bulk capsules down at the bottom, These, those, those like standard two inch basically. Yep. Okay. So this is like the best of both worlds for anyone that runs like Pokemon cards, especially you can see them on display here. I mean, just an amazing device. I can't wait to see how well this is going to do because I bet this is going to be awesome. 48 inches tall, fit in the back of your car, easy to move, you know, just use a dolly. Oh yeah, there you go. I mean, like li literally guys, it comes up to like, to like my, my abdomen here. So, I mean, that's how, that's how tall it is. Great for, you know, spots that don't have a lot of space. And just look at all this amazing stuff here, guys. So many cool things here. Look at all this. This is so awesome. Great setup, Kevin. This is awesome, man. Yeah. Very cool. Let's go take a look at this magic cut over here. So this is uh, basically like a barber cut style game, except it's not the full size like barber cut. It's uh, much smaller, obviously. Um, looks really cool. Look at that. And um, so, so how does this work? So obviously, like a, like a typical barber cut, you would have the prize hanging on the string. You cut the string, and the prize drops. Yep. So how does this work? It different. Does it does the string open a door, or how does this work? Cut the string. There's okay. tension on that string. Right. Right. So when that tension releases, it pops the door open. Oh, um, it pops the whole door open. Oh, the whole door. Okay. So then you just take the prize out. Take it out of there. Um, obviously, we're integrating with NIAC, so sure, as an operator, sure. you're going to get that notification. Yes, when the prize has been won. Yes. yes oh, yes. okay. You Look at that. I mean, must have on any of any of the bar cups. Barber cuts, uh, cut the screen machines, you know, even the bigger ones. It's still that one win takes all type of mentality. Yes. You gotta have a way as an operator to know. Of course, that win of happens. course, absolutely. Good stuff. And then look at these super mini machines. I mean, these are, you know, dear to so many of us out there, right? Um, I've been uh, talking about maybe uh, acquiring some of these here too. 
Um, and this is exactly what the winner of the giveaway will be receiving. And then look how awesome these are. They, they hold so much product, which I don't know if you guys can always see in the videos, how deep that play field goes. I mean, it just gives so much space to stock up with product. And, you know, we've seen it in, in, in Extreme's videos. You've seen it in Howard Hospitality's videos. Like, it just stores so much. And, you know, of course, you got the prize lockers up top. And we're integrating Pokemon stuff as we should be because everybody wants to play for the Pokemon stuff. So how cool is that? It's got nice, beautiful LED lights. Just amazing. And it fits just about anywhere. So definitely check out candymachines.com. There you go, right there. And... Um, Place your orders, guys. This play, this stuff is awesome. So cool. Here's kind of your two in one, too. Play for one or play for the other, and it might be a, even a, a vend or win every time. It's called Let It Happen. Beautiful machines. So cool. All right. Kevin, thank you so much for allowing us to take a look around. You guys have an amazing products here. They're very cool stuff. Appreciate it. Yeah, where's uh, where's the, the the giant gumball machine located? The Nyax. Nyax is over there? Yeah. All right, we'll definitely go check it out. Yeah, go check Thanks it out. Thanks again, man. We appreciate it. All right, have a good one. <laughs> Here we go, some more uh, capsule machines and different cool stuff. This is a nice one too, look at this. So this is a tops machine. You could do uh, packs of cards, you could do packs of Pokemon cards. Look at that, it vends just like that. How cool is that? This is a nice looking machine too. Especially if you know, you know the kids are always after the Pokemon cards. You can do whole packs rather than just bulk Pokemon cards. That would save you time in stuffing folders and you could do whole actual packs there. Those would sell out very well, that's awesome. Looks like that's with BV. Check it out, man. How cool is that? That's an awesome machine. It's great. You know, so so we do a lot of Pokemon stuff yeah. on our route, and the Pokemon just kills it for us. Like everybody loves. They can't, they can't find it in the stores. So like, so tell me tell me more about this machine here. Well, it's a dispenser. Yeah. Right. And it's really cool because. You can set the price whatever you want. Yeah, right, of course. Take your credit card. Just With your Nyx reader, yeah, there you go. So, so if you want to make this all booster packs, you're yeah. free to do that. How much does it hold? Uh, 250. 250 packs. Is it easy to load? Very easy. Yeah. They stack like a sticker machine. Is there, is there like a weight on top of them yeah. too? Okay, all right. That's so awesome. Packs, ten packs. That's so awesome. You can make your own packs, you know. Yeah. You something else that's a Could you do like the folders too if you want to do smaller, smaller amounts of cards? No, they, they just. They, they, but I mean, why would you want to do folders if you could do these, right? This is what people want, for sure. They yeah. Want Pokemon. Yeah, so exactly. Like its own little retail store. That's so awesome. Packs. Man. And uh, this, this is what is available coming in quarter three. Quarter three. All right, we'll, we'll definitely look out for it. Ready to go. Very cool, Walt. Awesome. Thanks for sharing. That's so, so awesome looking. There's going to be a lot of people looking for these. That's really cool. Thanks for sharing. You're welcome. Yeah. All right. Let's make our way over here. There's more stuff over here. Look at this Sweet Treat machine. Sweet Treat King would like that. That's very cool. Hello. How's it going? We're just uh, loving all this stuff here. There's so much great stuff. Uh, yes, I'm an all-star customer, actually. Yes, I am. Uh, yes, I order a lot of um, like flat vending stuff. Uh, I do. I I, li I really like the Pokemon cards, so I get like the, the folders and stuff. But from Flatline, I also have um, a lot of the poppets and like fidget toys. That's yes. I think uh, that's that was my last order. Uh, okay. So so do you know what the next big thing is? Uh, well, that's what we're all trying I know to figure what out, our, right? Our thing is. But in terms of flat. Just in general, like what you, I we're mean, we're trying to figure out what the next fad is going to be. You know, as aren't we all, right? Right. I've been I've been making my daughter ask the kids at school like oh, what yeah, they're into. You know, you know, you know, and it's just I just have I have yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. I was I was I missed out on the fidget spinners, and I think I was late yes. to the party on the poppets and stuff like that. So yeah. I'm trying to get ahead of the curve this time around. Well, I mean, anything squeezy. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, squishy good. stuff. Yeah. yeah. So our mesh balls are probably our best seller. Next yeah. Time. Yeah. Yeah. So Very do you cool. Have two inch I do have some two-inch okay. machines, yeah. Do you have cranes? I do have cranes. Okay, so I've I mean, got this is our crane mix here. 
Yes, that's what I was looking at there. There's yeah. so many cool things in there. I yeah. see so there's like the stress stuff. ball stuff. Yeah. There's yeah. like kind of koosh ball kind of things. Yeah, it's Ducks. Really nice color plush. Color. Yeah. Okay. So we're selling that. Awesome. Uh, we sell all of our redemption stuff. Like yeah, yeah. Yeah. So here, redemption and crane toys. Okay. So, uh, Very cool. All the prices are on the website or in our catalog. Um, there's also a show special going on. So. What's the show special? Well, depending on the product. Okay. But all right. All off for okay. Great. All right, what's your name? Alyssa. Alyssa, I'm Matt. Nice to meet you. Thank you so much for showing me around. Appreciate you. Yeah, you guys are awesome, so thank you. Very cool stuff. I'm in South Carolina. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Yes. Okay. All right. Well, thank you. Okay, thank you. Care. Appreciate you. All right, so look at all those gumballs. All right, let's take a look at the gumballs for just a minute. So many cool things here. I mean, who knows what the next big thing is? So obviously, you see your double bubble up there. But uh, well, some of my favorites are things that are sour. I do like these black cherry ones. Those are cool. Strawberry banana is good. Very cherry is a very popular one right there. Very cherry. Um, I don't see the blow pop gumballs though. So I wonder if that's another company. I don't know. Maybe I'm just blind. But uh, let's see what else. Oh, here's blow pop, blow pop gumballs right here. So there you go. That is what we think the next big thing is going to be. Those limeades might be pretty good. Who knows? Let's see what else we can find. Here is Cardinal Vending. And they've got all kinds of cool bulk stuff. Let's take a look around for just a minute. Hey, guys. Doing? We're doing good. Oh, we love these displays. This is awesome. All the gold stuff. Kids love the gold stuff. You know? <laughs> so cool. Great setup you guys had here. This is awesome. For sure. Here is Flatline Vending. They have some awesome stuff too. Look at all of this cool stuff. If you're into bulk vending, look at all this amazing stuff. So I know some of our some of our friends are doing stuff like this, which has all really, really been good. Um, <laughs> they got meme stickers. You can't go wrong with meme stuff. Everybody loves memes, right? Like how cool is all that incognito? That's so funny. And then they got all the different tattoos. Hello Kitty, look at that. Everyone loves Hello Kitty. Surprise eggs, you can't go wrong with those. Everybody loves the mystery stuff. So many cool things. And then of course, Pokemon. There you go, that's awesome. Hello, how are you? I am well, and you? I'm doing great. Good. Yes, we're just kind of looking around. You guys have an amazing display, very Thank cool. You. Yeah, love all the prizes, mm -hmm. good stuff. Awesome. Beautiful machines you got on, on display. Yep, and now a couple of these are, these are easy amusement. Grant is yes. actually right next yeah, to Yeah, we just talked to Grant a little bit ago. Yep. Uh, so so are, are these your prize mixes that you have inside? Yes. Okay. Yep, so this is a candy machine item, uh, but everything that's in it is ours. And yes. if you order anything from Grant, okay. it will come with a come, bill come, of our Come semester. ready to go. Awesome, yep, all right. with our stuff in it. So. so do you guys also, I see you have some 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 larger size stuff too, because you know it feels like a lot of the, all the focus on the mini machines today, mm -hmm. right? But you also have some larger stuff too, which is yep. really cool. And I see like you've got some cool stuff in your prize lockers down here. Very nice. That's awesome. Yep. Awesome. Well, we've uh, we've been looking around. Like I said, love your stuff. So. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'll take that. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Nice to meet you. You too. Take care. All right. You too. All right. So many amazing people here with amazing stuff. There's the AA Global display. Let's go check out AA Global. As you know, we do a lot of business with AA Global. They get a lot of great deals on plush and prizes. So let's take a look around here. How's it going? I'm doing well. Thank you. Yes. I'm doing well. Yes. I'm doing well. Yes. I'm doing well. Yes. I'm doing well. Yes. All right. I got a quick question for somebody. Go ahead. Um, the, the, the quick question is, everybody's asking, is NFL licensed stuff coming back? I don't know yet. We don't know yet? Okay. Because I know like, 
wasn't our choice. Okay, I, I imagine so, but I, a lot of people are looking for like the helmets and stuff like that to come back. The, the NFL reduced their licensees by X percent. Oh, okay. We were unfortunately one of the that, That's unfortunate, yeah. Well, maybe someday, right? Maybe someday. Well, cool. Well, thanks. I hope so. Yeah. A lot of stuff yeah. Between stickers and uh, yeah. And capsules. And Absolutely. Keychains and. For sure. For sure. Awesome. Well, amazing display. Thanks for thanks for letting us take a look around. Absolutely, not a problem. Anytime. Right, thank you. All right. They have it all. If you need if you need anything, vending AA Global has so many good things. Here's uh, kind of uh, some mixtures of the generic plush. We order that all the time. And then here would be a lot of the licensed stuff. Uh, what's cool about coming to these shows is you can kind of see the size in person. Um, and you never know. You never know, like, like for instance, I got those Care Bears down there in one video. And they were a lot smaller than I expected. But here you get to actually see how big everything is in person. So look at all this plush, guys. <laughs> so much cool stuff. All right, making our way over here. What's next? Here is Pipeline Games, and you can see all these great machines. Here's a lot of the cut to win machines. You get these big stuffed animal plush in here, and then look at that. So cool. This one's got, um, how does this work? This is a perfect 10. Insert money. Choose your prize, stop the timer at exactly 10, and you win. So you're gonna stop the timer at exactly 10, and then it vends like a stacker minor prize with, or, or major prizes would vend too. That's a cool, that's a cool concept. You know, we're kind of looking for something to replace our stacker machine, so you never know what we might come across today. And this is really cool right here too. This is a electronic vending right here. So multiple options on these machines. Very cool. All right, so that's Pipeline Gaming. Uh, let's take a look over here. Here's some, some, some full-size stuff. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right. If you guys haven't figured it out, I'm a bit overwhelmed today. There's so many cool things. Let's make our way over to the Nyax booth. Let's see what they got over there. I'm told it's over here, so let's make our, let's see what we can figure out. All right, there's some arcade multi cades there. Pretty cool stuff. What is over here? Man, check this out. Sniper Strike 2. That's a crazy looking game right there. Coming to an arcade near you. All right, I see it. I see it. Let's go take a look over here. Here's some VR arena amazingness. I see a very large gumball machine over here. Let's go take a look. So look at this, guys. For those of you that don't know, this is about to be a famous giant gumball machine full of blowpot gumballs with a Nyax credit card reader on it. It's a giant beaver from candymachines.com machine. Let's get our picture with it, ready? Quick Play is taking this machine to their mall. Right after the show, it's getting shipped to Missouri to go to Quick Play's mall. So how cool is that, right? Look at that, guys. There it is. This machine is about to be Quick Play famous. So go check it out. Watch it, for, watch it on, on their videos soon. And just know, I touched it. I touched this machine. <laughs> <laughs> right on the Nyx reader, all right. So this is the Nyx display and they've got all kinds of cool stuff. Look at these new readers here from Nyx. They're like puck shaped. And then there's your typical VPOS touch. So how cool is that? I am curious about these though. These are really nice looking. They're kind of futuristic. You got the whole lighted ring around them. And as you know, we have a discount code available. Galaxy Games 843 when checking out with Nyax. Save yourself some cash. How cool is this? Very awesome. All right, so we're going to walk around some more. We're definitely going to see what we can see. Over here, I can see more claw machines. And I see 
one of our fellow YouTube channels, Howard Hospitality Group over here. Let's sneak up on him. Look at this guy. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I, know I, am, I am not live right now. Are you oh, live? We're live. All right. So, so Jonathan here is live, right? Um, I am not live. I'm pre-recording. So this will be a, re a video released later for me. Oh, there you go. See what um, you're getting up before it even so, comes out. So, yes. So you're kind of getting that little wow. sneak preview right here. So go make sure you check out Howard Hospitality Group. They've got some amazing content, doing some great interviews in the industry. And uh, obviously, they're with us in our live stream, so you got to you got you got to go. Chat. Yes, you got to go support Howard Hospitality Group. Um, yeah, so check Thank them out, you. guys. Yeah, nice. for sure. Okay, we're gonna live stream tonight, and what are we doing tonight? We're giving away what? We're giving away the claw machine. A tonight. super mini claw machine. I, so I, I just I just went and filmed over at the CandyMachines.com table. And, and display, man, their setup is awesome. Were you over there yet? Yeah, we went oh, by. Oh my God, it's insane. That new machine is going to be a game changer. Oh my God. Oh, I cannot wait. I'm so excited. Yes, I mean, honestly, it's going to be amazing. Very Look cool. at that. So here, we're on the stream. <laughs> we're on the stream. <laughs> oh my God, awesome, guys. So cool. Look at these. These are cute. Yeah, yeah. Who's, whose setup is this? This is SMB Toy and Crane. This is SMB Toy yeah. and Crane. Okay. Yeah. So then the, these little, like these little ones, guys, are super cute. Check these out, like little glow top. What I really like is how lit up they are, yeah, right? Yeah, that's what I mean. So, like, like that was the one thing, the one problem I had with my Mini before I upgraded to a full-size crane was that people, it wasn't catching the eye. People were missing it, so therefore they weren't playing it because it was so short, right? But this, obviously, I mean, how do you miss this? Yeah, you can. This is like blaring in your eye. Like the, the kid, the kids are going to see this, right? Yeah, the, those those pyramid tops yeah. with the color changing LED, so cool. And then I see some some other machines over here too that look awesome. So here are the these claws look awesome. The black box, all LED with the rainbow lights. I mean, how cool is that? Looks amazing. And then. Uh, yeah, I was. I am loving that machine, the black box machine. How awesome does that look? That is amazing. They've got some really nice stuff on display here. Yeah. Oh my God, you guys! Oh, I am. I want to buy everything, right? I just want to buy everything. I mean, you could. I could see how people could go broke at a place like this because we just want everything we see. These machines are so beautiful and so bright. Okay. It does say something about does something have a stand? Yeah, okay. Does something have a what? Somebody was asking if something had a stand, but I didn't have my glasses. Oh, on. oh, didn't see it. Okay, guys, ask your comment again. You know, you can you can do this. Right? You can oh, no, you, you, you can see that. the comments like that. Uh, it does. Elout cranes also have a stand. Oh, that's Jorn. Hey, Jorn. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I would have to see the Elout crane. Um, are they tabletop or something? How, how, why, would, why would they need a stand? Are they not full size? Or? I don't know. I don't know which ones he's talking about. I haven't seen any allowed machines today. Um, but again, I'm only, I've only scratched the surface. I've only, yeah. been, I've only been recording for about 30 minutes. Yeah, this is 77 so, minutes. So you're, you're just streaming <laughs> like crazy over here. This is awesome. Hey, Jordan. Thanks for saying hey. <laughs> <laughs> hey, make sure you guys smash that like button too. You know, yes, you, please, you, 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 you got to share and, and, and help everyone out. And I hope you guys are all going to join us this evening. It's going to be crazy. It's probably going to be a mess, but we're still going to get it done. So 3 p.m. Pacific, 3 6 p.m. Eastern that, time. That's for, that's for the giveaway, not for the live stream. Right. Yes. Okay. The live stream, we have some special guests tonight. Uh, we'll see how that goes. Okay. Things might be unorganized. Like I said, <laughs> I'm just, I just want to set the expectation that the live stream will be very unorganized. You guys, uh, you guys have seen who's here, so right. you kind of so have ev an idea. Everybody's that. here. I don't know if we can get everyone in one place especially for two hours so yeah. it might be a, a come and go kind of thing i don't know we'll see what happens but no matter what just expect it's going to be messy but we're going to have so much fun doing it <laughs> so just know that all right all right you guys let's keep going all right oh i see some pay range stuff over there let's all right all right jonathan we'll talk to you later yeah, man yeah, yeah, thanks you. again make sure you subscribe to howard hospitality group yep, yes there we go all right i'll see you guys in a bit all right, bye guys. All right, so let's make our way back over here. I saw so many things I missed walking over here, but I wanted to make sure I got over to that section too before this video got too long. But guys, how amazing is this show? This show is super amazing. There's so many cool things. 
My goodness. I mean, things you don't even think about. Check out, all right, let's go, let's go look at this, this theater machine over here. This is a portal of fun QBX machine, it says, and it's literally a wraparound screen. How cool is that? Look at that. Wow. It's got multiple projectors up top in order to shoot the images down on the walls. Oh, that is amazing. Super cool. Oh, I am overwhelmed. Here's some axe throwing stuff and different uh, like kind of kind of those kind of places. Here's uh, your candy setups. Look at all these guys over here. <laughs> all, all, all the true players over here, guys. Hey, guys, how's everyone doing, guys? What's up? There we go. All right. You know who all those guys are, right? All right. So, so guys, I want you to throw in the comments some of the machines you've seen that you thought were really cool or maybe might be game changers or things that you think are going to be the next thing, right? So we've talked to multiple distributors today. We talked to all kinds of people in the industry. We're trying to figure out what's going to be the next big thing prize-wise and machine-wise. So if you've got ideas or things you saw so far today that you think are going to make a difference, put it in the comments and let us know. I am impressed with how many people are here, too. I mean, obviously, you know, in the past couple years, things have been rough for vending in general. But I think uh, days like today really make you think it's, it's coming back hard. There's a lot of money to be made. All right. So we've already been over here. You know, we, we, we looked at the Stern pinball setups. Let's go to the left. Um, I think this is going to be a little bit different kind of stuff over here. A lot of this is like pool table billiard stuff, home game room stuff. We've got shuffleboard over there. Uh, different games like this. All right, let's see. This is a uh, Valley Dyn Dynamo. All right, so I use Dynamo arcade cabinets. Oh, look at that. The ball is just floating there in midair. How cool. Can you see that? I don't know if the camera's picking that up very well, but you probably you've got some, some, some beer chillers there. That ball's crazy. You can play some, uh, some, some jet hoops. How cool is that? And then there's some really long shuffleboard tables. Those are awesome looking. We got air hockey over here. So Valley Dynamo, made in the USA, awesome stuff. There we go. I love that find a key machine right there too. That would be amazing on Ralph because these find a key machines, they have prize lockers at the bottom. So that's cool to see. I would love to have one of those. Here's a really big claw machine. Got some squishmallows, some emoji balls in there. Awesome stuff. Whose setup is this? That is really big crane company. That's awesome. I love these uh, glitter ducks in there. Those are awesome. I always like to check out the prizes in, in the machines too, because you know, in a show like this, a company that wants to sell those machines is gonna put their best stuff in those machines too. So I always want to see what your, everyone's opinion of the best stuff is. Because obviously, you want the best stuff in your machines, because then you know kids are going to want to play for it. <laughs> All right, here's the American Pinball Company, Legends of the Halo, Galactic Tank Force. Let's see what we got over here. These are all their newest machines. You know I love me some pinball. There's the, the Hot Wheels machine, and then you guys, we always talk about the stream. You want to see what the underneath of the pinball play field looks like? Look at that. It's a mess. So awesome, though. When I say working on pinball is not easy, that's what I'm talking about right there. Look at that, guys. When you go under the hood of pinball, it can be a very overwhelming experience. So that's what I mean when I talk about that. All right, here's some VR setups. Let's check. Let's take a look at this. And I'm, I'm going to have to go get some water here pretty soon. I've been talking a lot. Are you guys sick of hearing me talk yet? You just want to walk around and see what's to see without, without hearing me talk about it? I don't know. All right, let's go up here. Here's Chicago Gaming Company. They are doing the remakes of a lot of the, uh, the pinball machines that have gotten kind of hard to find. And right off the bat, I see Cactus Canyon up here. 
as you know, that is a very desirable pinball machine. So they started to do the remakes here. Let's take a look at these Cactus Canyon machines. Oh, that's beautiful. Those are awesome. They've also got the Pulp Fiction machines. And look how they have those kind of classic solid state displays up there. No, uh, no dot matrix displays. They got these, those classic solid state machines, uh, solid state displays, which is uh, really cool. I'm sure they're all LED at this point, but back in the day, they were not. Amazing. Man, there is a whole nother section up here. All right, let's go take a look and see what's up, what else is up here. All right, so you know I gotta point this out. So I'm originally from Northeast Ohio, so there's a Cedar Point fellow. Funny to see in Las Vegas. My home amusement park for so long. Look at all these cool squishmallows here too. Awesome stuff. This is what we like to see. This is, these are all the cool prizes the kids wanna play for. Uh, we got sloths, we got dogs, we got frogs, ducks, cows, unicorns, bears, you name it, they've got it here. But the Squishmallows is what everybody wants. Look at those avocado ones. Those are cool. And the pig dressed up as a frog. So cool. All right, what else we got? Here's a lot of the laser tag setup. Check out those systems. If you run a laser tag center, this is where you want to be to see everything. Because this is all the cool stuff. All right, let's make our way back down to the main floor. Ah, oh, guys, I'm so overwhelmed. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this video. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. I haven't asked all video, but make sure you subscribe to Galaxy Games 843. Hit that bell notification too, so you get notified when new videos and live streams go live. Show me, the, show me some love for uh, coming all the way to Las Vegas to show you all this cool stuff. All right, so we got sidetracked over here at these steps. So I'm gonna make my way back up to this area. I'm gonna head left instead of right. So let's go see what's over here. There were some other things that caught my eye. I wasn't sure what they were. This, uh, what's this Florida Vice? Can you see that in the camera? InQuest Florida Vice. Looks like it could be some sort of VR type setup. Let's make our way over here. Yeah, a lot of VR stuff over here. Okay. Here we go. Notice there's no locations in South Carolina there. Maybe we should change that someday, right? Here's what I was, okay, so this is like saw, like an animated slot kind of machine. That's cool though. Distributors want it, if you want to get in on it, Flow Device by Linquest. Awesome stuff. Here's the IAPA display. You know, the IAPA show is coming in November. If you're into amusement parks and other stuff, that is the place to be. Cool stuff there. All right, let's make our way back over here. I saw a pay range had a setup. Let's see what is in the pay range setup. They got some nice vending machines on display with pay range products or pay range uh, payment systems in it. They offer mobile payment systems uh, if you don't want to go the whole way of having a NIAX credit card reader on your machine. Of course, I recommend NIAX, but someone might prefer pay range over that. We got indoor play areas, Funovation. All kinds of party center software stuff. All right, we've, uh, we've been all over the place today. We've seen so many cool things. Uh, I've gone for, looks like about 45 minutes so far. So hopefully you guys are still watching. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the content. Again, make sure you give this video a like, give it a thumbs up, throw some comments down below of all the machines you saw, you thought are gonna do well in the future. What machines would you wanna put on your vending route or if you were starting a vending business, what machines would you put in it? I'm overwhelmed with how many cool things are here today. Oh, I see a bunch of Mario plush over here and some different cool stuff. Is that ramen plush? Look at that, guys. They got strawberry milk. They got ramen plush. All this Mario Nintendo licensed stuff. Pac-Man. Oh, look at those Pac-Man ones. There's all that cool stuff on it. That is awesome. Very cool. Whose display is this? It says Sure Shot Redemption at the top. I'm loving all the ramen stuff. This is the kind of stuff the kids want, right? So this is, uh, they have a lot of like prize kind of prizes. For if, you got, if you want ticket machines. I love all the giant candy themed stuff, but oh, all those cool plush over there. 
That's SureShot Redemption. Check them out, SureShot, SureShot-Redemption.com. Very cool stuff. I'm definitely going to have to go check them out. And then we got, uh, looks like, a bunch more plush over here. Lots of licensed stuff. Look at all this Pokemon plush. There's Magikarp. You know Magikarp is my favorite because he's so silly. But, oh, my gosh, I am overwhelmed with all the cool licensed plush here, guys. There's Peppa Pig. There's Sonic. There's Minecraft. Of course, Pac-Man. Scooby-Doo. Looney Tunes. Over there, I see South Park. Willy Wonka. Is there a Kenny over here? i got to see. So there's Cartman. Butters. Kyle. I don't see a Kenny. I thought that was Kenny, but that's uh, that's from Family Guy, not not Kenny. That's Lois. What do you mean, Lois? All right, so many cool things there. But the problem is, I don't see which company this is. But check out all that cool plush. So many licensed things. There's Batman over here, Rick and Morty, Sesame Street, and they got some looks like some non-licensed stuff over here too. So many cool things. Awesome, I'm impressed, that is awesome. All right, let's make our way back this way. And at this point, we're just kind of randomly flying around, guys. You never know what you're gonna find. There's the NBVA setup. They got all kinds of cool stuff here too. They're running lots of raffles today too to help promote the NBVA. So if you're interested in joining, go check them out, nbva.com. You can't go wrong. All right, I think we missed some of this stuff over here. So let's take a look over here. So here's some fun time claw machines. Very nice light lighted front. And look how deep the claw goes on that side. That's awesome. Here's your typical cotton candy vending machine. All right, let's see it work. Let's watch it work. That's awesome. It just it just puts it together on the stick just like that, and it's probably gonna add different colors, the flavors, and stuff. Probably shape it. <laughs> it's gonna shape it now. It's building the base. It'll just add more to it at that point. <laughs> How cool is that? Probably making a flower or some, some device like that. Very awesome. And it smells so good. I know you guys can't smell, but it smells so good right there. It smells like fresh, hot, warm cotton candy. Oh. Look at all these cool carpets, too. If you run home game rooms or for family fun centers. Oh, this carpet is awesome for black lights. Look at all this cool stuff. I would love to have some of this carpet for my home game room, but uh, I don't want to run black lights. But how cool is that? So many cool things here. It's all black light. See, they got the black lights on up above to make it nice and reflective. So many cool designs. That's awesome. Here's a quick shot game. Those are some pretty realistic guns, too. Crazy stuff. You got your, your standard kitty rides over here. There you go, and different basketball machines. Oh, I, I am definitely needing some water after this video, for sure. So I'm going to be wrapping up here pretty soon. i got to go get some water. I've been talking this whole time, and I feel like my voice is starting to show it. What is all this, though? All VR games. Look at all this cool stuff. We got Zombieland Headshot Fever. This is a synth, synth Riders, a dance action game. Nice stuff. Oh, it looks like we might have the raw thrills set up over here. Let's go check it out. There's the Rhode Island novelty setup. That's a great spot to get plush and prizes. What is all this over here? 
So this is like a VR ride type game, right? So, put your VR headsets, fans for wind and air, use your hands to play, and that's kind of what it looks like there. You gotta catch coins and different objects as you go. It's kind of like a roller coaster looking type ride. Looks pretty sweet though. And then here's a fully immersive get inside of a cube. Q U B E. How cool is that? It's huge. And look at how amazing that picture looks. Looks like it's amusement themed. Those graphics are so good. Oh, that looks like so much fun. It's almost like a dark ride type game. Very cool. All right, let's make our way back over here. I see all kinds of cool games over here. So these are the games that the kids love to play too. We got Nitro Trucks, we got Super Bikes 3. These are the ones too that have the fans up above and blow the wind on you as you're driving. Look at that. We got speakers, lights, just so cool. see some new Fast and Furious games over here, and it's very congested right here. So we'll make our way over to the new Fast and Furious games. Here we go, look at their, their vertical screens, like two screens stacked on top of each other. Look at how amazing those graphics are. This is new from Raw Thrills, and they've got the built-in cameras to get your picture taken, all that stuff. That looks so awesome, guys. Look at that. Two screens stacked on top of each other. You'll see those at Dave & Buster's in the coming years, I'm sure. Those look amazing. Universal, Fast and Furious arcade games by Raw Thrills. Looks super sweet. That's what we like to see. All right, I think we've been around the floor 1.5 times at this point, so we've seen some things a couple times. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Ah, oh, I am super overwhelmed here today, guys. This is amazing stuff. All the awesome, cool new stuff. I really hope you guys are enjoying this video. Again, thank you so much for watching the videos. We really appreciate everyone's support. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. I came all the way to Las Vegas to film this content for you, so make sure you give it a like. Make sure you're subscribed to Galaxy Games 4.3. Show me some love, guys. Help me out. With that said, I think we're gonna wrap the video up right here. We'll probably do some more one-on-one -on -one stuff. But who knows? We got a lot of great content coming away from Las Vegas. If you haven't done so yet, go check out our vlog travel video as we came to Las Vegas. And uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying. So again, we're going to wrap it up right here. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, guys, it's overwhelming. There's so many cool things here. All right. Make sure you like and subscribe. It really does help us out. Thanks so much for watching. We're going to wrap it up, though, guys. This is Matt with Galaxy Games 843. We'll see you next time.